Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, I learned all this stuff just from playing Sonic the Hedgehog games. Sonic the Hedgehog games just took me to a whole frequency of uh, seeing everything around me at for what it really is. Because if you've seen any Sonic games, you would look at all these zones and these stages. Like you got Green Hill, you got Marble Garden, Spring Yard, Collision Chaos. All these stage names in the Sonic games, it tells you everything about all these different planets and and all these quadrants that just exist you know all at once you know like to put it to put it like this every single arc in every anime is playing all at once in nonfiction. yeah so it's like it's kind of like just the stages just the 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 uh, the adventure if you will you know what i'm saying um the going here going there but it's all truly an illusion and it's all the same thing but it's just the scenery and the state of being and uh, you feel me and uh, you feel me so i do get it and it most definitely is hard to put into words but i remember a couple of the sonic games <coughs> And I also do know about the coins, the Sonic coins. I was hearing someone about uh, about if you like how if you go too fast in life and you rack up too much energy, you can get too many coins. It was interesting, but I don't I don't know, so I'm not gonna speak on it because I don't remember that too much. Talk about Cosmo Worlds from the Sonic games. Talk about Cosmo Worlds. Like, if you just look on Google, you see all the Sonic stages. Like, you just type in Sonic CD, Sonic Adventure, Sonic Adventure 2, Sonic Advance 3. They're going to show you, like, a whole Cosmo world out there. Mm, okay, I get it, bro. I get it, bro. It's like, <clears throat> for example, Collision Chaos will be its own realm, if you will. You feel me? And on on collision chaos because I feel like Earth is like one of those planets that it it it's weird because it's it's real but it's like it's fucked up though like it's it's the frequency of Earth it's a real planet bro it's like a a godly made planet but the inhabitants and the way we move on earth is not godly so it's like i feel like these realms like collision chaos and shit would also exist on earth like on earth you could tap into the frequency of a collision chaos but you can't get stuck on collision chaos you can't get stuck on that level you can't try to get all the rings on that level because you got to keep going because it's going to be a whole another level that awaits for you, a whole another part of the cosmos, a whole another place that, that, that awaits for you. Can't be scared to, to die or to leave Collision Chaos and go into the unknown. And I feel like that just goes to the fear because all these worlds exist inside of us. And, you know, they really did make us fear self so it's like you know that that does you feel me absolutely you're correct and also the stage after collision chaos is tidal tempest tidal tempest is like a oceanic world that you go into after you after you get past collision chaos and then after tidal tempest world there there's a world called quartz quadrant Bro, it seems as if you go from, like, um, a chaotic world to, so like, hell, in a sense, which would be collision chaos, to more so um, the mental plane. I, I had had this picture. I probably should have took a picture. But then you'll go to the mental plane or the water plane, you know, water, thoughts, clouds, water, you know how it goes. And so... <clears throat> I feel like you go to that water plane and then you kind of make it to quartz, um, quartz quadrant, 
which is which sounds like a heaven to me. I mean, shit. If I look around and I see clear quartz everywhere, I'm gonna think I'm in a pretty high vibrational space, you know. So yeah, that's that's actually pretty magical, bro. Sonic fucking has gems. So like with Sonic CD, here's the thing that's gonna really, really match with everything that you're sharing, right? You know. So like you know, collision chaos like deals with like a chaotic existence on that planet, but then there's a thing like in Sonic CD where they show like past, present, and future, right? You know, depending on the things that you do as Sonic in Sonic CD, you can either create a good future or a bad future, or a good past or a bad past with Sonic, right? Like, you know, there's goalposts, there's like checkpoint goalposts in Sonic CD. Like, if you depend on what you do in that stage, you can either create like a good future or a bad future with Sonic. Same thing with the past and same thing with good past and a bad past too. And also the features in Sonic CD, you know, when it comes to the past and the future, like if you have like a bad past and the bad future the music has like a depressing theme to it but the good past and the good future in sonic cd has a upbeat healing frequency to the tunes